day three, looking for improvement from day day two, and, you know, and, and from day one. So I think there's a there's a, there's a little bit of energy, there's up tempo, there's you know guys are having fun, they're, they're you know they're, they're competitive, they're challenging each other, but you know uh, the main focus is is to get better as as you go along as they go along here. Ross is, uh, is taking his leadership role, you know, to heart. I mean, he lives it, breathes it, walks it, talks it, and um, you know, our guys look up to him as, as they do all the other uh, captains. Specifically, when it comes to the defense, you know, having pride in the secondary. I mean, that uh, you know, that's that's what he's interested in, and that's what he likes to he likes to promote that type of attitude about you know, don't throw my way. So. He'll be all right. Just uh, you know, just precautionary measures. He'll, he'll be he'll be out there today a little bit, doing a little bit of stuff, and then uh, when he's ready to go 100%, then uh, then he'll be out there. Want to make sure that uh, you know Perry Jones gets his reps. He ended number one, you know, coming out of spring practice, and now I believe uh, indications that Keith Payne is going to be all right academically, so he'll be in the mix. And you got Don Wallace, who's a star. Now he's on the men back, you know. And then you got KP, who's who's uh, you know, good back and stuff, and then Tory. So it's, uh, like I said, I think we're very talented in that position right there. Stay away with that bad. Stay back, good, stay low, go. Stay low, stay down, stay back, good. The receiving core has, has actually pretty, done a pretty good job. Um, you know, Tim Smith, he's as fast as I've always thought he was, and he's proved that on a couple of occasions. Chris Bird has, uh, you know, has, has become a really, really good route runner. Dontrell Inman, a tall, long, uh, wide receiver that can make plays, very athletic. And then we got a, you know, a, a second tier of guys that are pushing those guys. You know, the Jared Greens and, and the Snyder's. You know, uh, Dre Keys. So th there's a lot of competition going on there at the wide receiver position. And uh, you know, you can't put a whole bunch of them on the field at the same time. But you know, the, the ones that are out in front, as long as they know you got some guys behind them pushing, then uh, they got to stay on their A game. So it, it's been. Uh, a pleasant surprise to see the amount of uh, you know, long throws, the amount of catch after runs that uh, you know the guys have, have done thus far. But we still got a long way to go. A lot of practices left, and you know a lot of things to add. And just want to make sure that that athleticism can also deal with uh, you know, running the right plays and running the right routes.